Transferring crypto from Uphold to your Tangent wallet can be kind of confusing if you've never done it before. And if you do something wrong during the process, you could actually end up losing your crypto. However, once you've done it a couple times, it's actually really quick and easy. So in this video, I'll show you how to transfer any crypto from your Uphold account to your Tangent wallet. And I'll even show you how to transfer it back to your Uphold account. Plus, I'll show you some things you need to watch out for along the way. By the way, if you're watching this video and you decide that you want a Tangent wallet or maybe you're getting another one, use our discount code CYBERSKRILLA to get 10% off your entire order. Now let's talk Tangem. First things first, I wanna show you how to transfer crypto from your Uphold account to your Tangem wallet. So to start, sign into your Uphold account. And for this example, I'm sending Solana from Uphold to my Tangem wallet. As you can see, I've got a little over $3 in my Uphold wallet. So to start the transfer, we need to select the crypto we want to send to Tangem. So to do that, go to select source, then choose the crypto you want to send under the My Accounts tab. So I'm going to select my Solana account. And then next we need to select the destination. This is where we're sending our crypto to. So you can either select the cryptocurrencies tab or just search for whatever crypto you're sending. It's quicker to just search for it. So I'm going to search for Solana, then scroll until you find the crypto you're sending and select it. Now we need to enter the amount of crypto that we wanna send. You can switch between denominations using the arrows, but I prefer entering the amount in USD, which is my native currency. You can also choose between 25% to 100% of your balance. And since I'm sending sending all of my soul to my Tangent wallet, I'm just going to tap the use max button, which will send all the Solana in my Uphold account to my Tangent wallet. Next, we need to enter the receiving address from our Tangent wallet. So tap preview withdrawal, and this is where we'll enter that address. Now head over to your Tangent wallet, open the Tangent app on your phone and select the crypto you're trying to receive. If your token isn't on the homepage, you'll need to add it. So to add a token, tap manage tokens and then search for the crypto you're sending to your Tangent wallet. Since I'm sending Solana, I'll search for Solana and then I'll tap the drop down arrow and then I want to enable this token and then down here at the bottom, I just tap save changes. And now that I have Solana in my Tangent app, I'll get the receiving address by tapping on Solana, then tap receive and copy the receiving address. If you're using Uphold on your mobile device, you can just tap copy. However, since I'm using Uphold on my desktop computer, I need to get this address onto my computer. So I'm going to tap share and then I'm going to airdrop it to my computer. If you're not using an iOS device, then you can save the address to your phone and transfer the file to your computer. And then once you've copied your receiving address from your Tangent wallet, you wanna go back to Uphold and paste it into the recipient spot and then tap confirm to review the transaction. Here you can check how much you're sending, any fees that might apply, and the amount you'll receive in your Tangent wallet after the fees are taken out, along with the address you're sending the funds to. It's always a good idea to double check that the address in your Uphold account matches the receiving address in your Tangent wallet, that way you know you're sending it to the correct address. It's also a good idea to send a small test transaction first, like $10 at least, before you send the full amount of your crypto, at least until you get this process down just so you know you're not messing up and potentially losing your crypto if you do mess up. If everything looks good, then you can tap confirm transaction and you might see a message pop up asking you to select an option. Choose I am moving funds to my non-custodial wallet because that's exactly what we're doing here. Then tap next. Um, another message might appear warning you this may be a scam. Don't be too alarmed. Um, Uphold includes these warnings because many people have been tricked into sending their money to scammers, but we know this isn't a scam because we're transferring crypto to our Tangent wallet by choice, not because someone demanded we send it to an unknown address. That said, the scam warning section is worth reading through because it provides useful information that everyone should be aware of, but once you've gone through it, tap continue, then just enter your verification code, and after you enter that, tap continue again, and your crypto will be on its way to your Tangent wallet. The time it takes for your crypto to arrive varies depending on the type of crypto that you're sending. For example, this sole transaction only took a few seconds to receive in my Tangent wallet. However, if you're sending something like Bitcoin, it's probably going to take a bit longer just because it's a different network and it's a slower network. That said, if you have any questions about the status of your transaction, just go to the recent activity tab in your Uphold account, tap on your transfer transaction, and you can see its status. Once it says complete, your crypto should appear in your Tangent wallet shortly after. Okay, now that we've got our crypto in our Tangent wallet, you might be wondering how to send it back to Uphold when you're ready to take some profit and sell it. 
Um, I will show you that, but first I just wanna point out that you can actually sell crypto directly in the Tangem app with certain cryptocurrencies. Not all cryptocurrencies are supported, but if that's something you wanna do, then just tap on the crypto that you wanna sell in your app and then scroll over to the sell button. If it's grayed out, that means that crypto is not available to sell. However, if you can click on it, then go ahead and tap on it and then you just enter the amount of your crypto that you wanna sell, and then you just follow the rest of the steps on screen, and it's super straightforward. You can even send your crypto directly to your bank account from your Tangem wallet. Regardless, let me show you how to send your crypto from your Tangem wallet to your Uphold account, and don't worry because this process is even easier than sending crypto from Uphold to Tangem. So first, go to your Uphold account and select Source. Again, you want to select the crypto that you're sending to your Uphold account, so I'm going to search for Solana, and of course, I'm going to select that since that's what I'm receiving in my Uphold account. Uphold will then display the receiving address for your account. So tap show address to view it. And if you're using a mobile device, just copy the address and paste it into your Tangem app. Or since I'm on desktop, I'm just going to scan the QR code. All right, so open up your Tangem app, select the crypto that you want to send to your Uphold account and then tap send. So I'm going to tap Solana, tap send, and you can either paste your uphold receiving address into the recipient spot, or what I'm gonna do is use the QR code scanner. And then after entering the receiving address, you just tap next and enter the amount of crypto you want to send. I like to enter the amount in my local currency because I don't always know the exact value of the token that I'm sending. And you can either enter a specific amount or just tap max to send it all. Then tap next, and here you'll review the transaction details, including the address, the amount you're sending, and the network fee. And assuming everything looks good, just tap send and scan your Tangem card to confirm the transaction. It'll take a bit longer for your crypto to arrive in your Uphold account compared to transferring crypto from Uphold to Tangem. So just be patient. Eventually the transaction will appear under the recent activity tab in your Uphold account where you can check its status. And you might see that your total account balance is correct, but it shows $0 available. This is normal because the transaction is still processing. Once it's complete, your account balance will update to reflect the correct amount. So when sending crypto between Uphold and your Tangem wallet, there are some very important things that you need to be aware of that didn't come up during this Solana transaction, but that will come up with certain cryptocurrencies such as XRP. More specifically, this is called the destination tag. To clarify, you do not need a destination tag when sending crypto to your Tangem wallet. However, if you're sending crypto like XRP back to Uphold from your Tangem wallet, then you must include the destination tag provided by Uphold. Uphold, without it, your crypto will not arrive in your Uphold account. And don't worry because Uphold will let you know if a destination tag is required before showing you your receiving address. That said, there are also a bunch of other crucial tips and tricks that you should know to use your Tangem wallet securely and effectively. And I go over all those in this next video. So definitely check that out. I'll see you there. Peace out.